Good morning, grade five. The lesson today is how to insert comment. I will uh, use the lesson to understand a poem. So let me share to you how to do that. First and foremost, you open Microsoft Word. I already shared to you a poem about uh, To Helen by Edgar Allan Poe. Edgar Allan Poe is uh, one of the famous poets. And he wrote a poem entitled To Helen. Now, this poem, for you to understand more, you have to understand the words that he used. So we will apply the lesson how to insert comment in understanding the poem. First, you highlight the word that you don't understand. For example, the word Nicene, and then go to click review and comment. All right? So to find the meaning of the word, you have to go to internet and type the meaning of the word Nicaea there, because I presume Nicaea refers to the word Nicaea. So it's an ancient city in Greece. Nicaea is an ancient city on Greece. And then you go back to Word and type that meaning inside that comment, click that comment there and control V or just go to home and click paste. Okay? So the next thing, the next word that we need to uh, understand and find the meaning is the word wayward. What's the meaning of that? Go to review and comment. Go to internet and find the meaning of the word wayward. Wayward. Okay, that's the way. That's the meaning of the word wayward. Highlight, highlight the meaning, click right copy, and go back to Word. Click inside the comment where uh, the word wayworn is highlighted and control V to paste it. Okay? Next is the word hyacinth or, or hyacinth. Click review new comment. Go to Internet, find the meaning of hyacinth. Hyacinth. Hyacinth is a plant. Okay. It's a fragrant flowering plant. Okay. Okay. Copy that one, go to, <clears throat> go back to Word, and paste there. And then, how about this Nayad? Nayad. Go, go, go to, go back to the internet, type the word Nayad. It's a water name. It's a classical in a in a classical mythology. It's a water name. Okay, there. Click right, copy. Go back to Word and paste there inside the the uh, word Nayad. And then maybe uh, Agate. New command. Go to internet and find the word agate or agate. <laughs> What's the meaning of agate? It's commonly found in many different countries making, it's a common rock formation. What's the name? Oh, it's just a rock, no? Maybe it's a precious rock or a gem. Okay. Yeah. We will copy this one. It's a, it's a quartz. No? Okay. And go back to 
word and there. See? So with those words defining being defi defined more, you'll be able to understand the poem poem more. Okay? To understand the poem, you have to understand the meaning of those words that you don't understand precisely. Okay? And then that will help you appreciate the poem more. Okay? So again, thank you so much for listening and following this lesson. I hope you learn more, something more again uh, in computer and apply to real, uh, real situation or application. Okay? Thank you so much.